Okay. Uh, three, two, one. Hello, this is Fuzzy, and welcome to a new series, or whatever. But um, uh, I'm gonna call it Shit on Frames. I'm gonna be building uh, 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 frame machines, and well, that do different kind of things, and it'll differ from uh, each uh, episode what it'll do. So, and Victor's here to help me. So yes, yeah. I am. Hello. And for this thing. Uh, for this uh, episode, I decided we wanted to go make a nether pump. Basically, a, a pump that uh, 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 pumps the nether dry. So, <laughs> yeah. And for that, we have to go to the nether. So, yes, we do. Okay. And let's do this deal. Or just there. Okay. So uh, I'm gonna make a linking book. Okay. Cause I'll I'm gonna be too lazy to like travel to the portal. Wait, it's instant when you're in creative, yeah, right? It is. Oh well then, whatever. Okay. Oh. So where are we? We are in a weird spawn and is this gravel. Yes, it's gravel. Okay. So whatever. It's not the best nether spawn, but. We've got a huge ass lava lake, and this is exactly what we needed. And let's see. To do this, um, we have to start out by deciding what height we want our uh, frame machine to be at. Right. And. Because I could make an up, up and down function as well, but it's not really necessary. Well, like, if we just get it to work, then like, you know, if, if like, it's easy enough to just make it go up and down if we would like to, but we don't need that in creative, like. Yeah. So as long as it works. Uh, I'm and thinking yeah. not too high up, so I'm thinking if we start like over mm. here. <laughs> oh, I should turn the magnet mode on. Oh, okay. Uh, there we go. So, for this build, um, uh, basically this is uh, gonna be a build craft pump. Right. Uh, that uh, has um, uh, uh, some frame motors and stuff on it. Yeah. So this is the pump, this is the heart of the machine, and it's going to pump into the, into the thing. So this is going to pump us the... This lava like is seven box deep. <laughs> cool. <laughs> okay. So I thought of a really cool way of doing it. I tested this in a, in a single player world, so I know I, what I'm doing for once. Um, um, should I just like make the same thing? Oh yeah. yeah. It's yeah. like this. It's a pattern that goes around. Nice. Oh, you, yeah, you're doing the two by two engines of the stuff. Yeah. Uh, one block high thing and stuff. Okay, so it's like this. And, um, um, yeah. well, what do I need? Okay, uh, Victor, you decide. Um, what right. do we want for covers and panels? And what Ooh. do we want to look, make it look like? I want to make it look a bit like, you know, <laughs> not dangerous, but, you know, it's it's like a lava thingy. Yeah, we so should make it nether thingy. So nether, maybe like nether, nether brick for panels. Well, covers. Okay. Well, we don't really need that many uh, panels at all, so we could so just yeah. do the same thing. So, nether Oh, yeah. Brick. Nether brick, nether brick. You can spawn them both in. So, nether brick. And the uh, cover the panel. And break panels. Okay, so first of all, um, I wanted to play some uh, things here because uh, below this thing, uh, uh, well, in this block, it's gonna be a oh motor. Maybe? No. <laughs> okay, battery box maybe. Yes, battery box. Um, should I please covers all around? 
And well, no, aren't we gonna have campers there? Are, are you gonna have anything there? Or? Uh, yeah. Oh. So we're gonna do this yeah. and put the batteries inside there, in the corner of each of those. And the way we do this, um, uh, this will actually be a very cool way of getting all the directional drives for uh, side to side and uh, forward back uh, in a nice symmetrical pattern. So yeah, is no OCD. <laughs> yeah, this is really, really good. So Where is the portal located? Up here. Okay, nice. So I just know it in case. <laughs> yeah. So we don't get I lost or something. I didn't uh, make any screens of it. So. Uh, or, uh, uh, what is it? Waypoints? Waypoints. But, yeah, you could always, like, keep it actually open. So, oh, yeah. So, um, let's see. We want to have... Oh, yeah. The covers. We want to cover these guys. The okay. other side of the corner. Because that's where, uh, in each of those, uh, the, the frame over will be when it has to go back. So it uh, can't stick the frames there. So that's one thing. Um, mm -hmm. And now we're going to need the frame motors. Yeah. And I guess we need some frame motors then. Okay. And they just go in the other two blocks, right? Yeah. And we're going to, yeah, place them. In the Worry about that later. Um, I have a screwdriver okay. ready. So, so um, uh, what are we going to do here? Um, um, I uh, think, yeah, I think it was this one. This one, this one, this one, this one. And, yeah, okay, so. Those are panels? Yeah, those are panels, and those will have wireless uh, 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 frequency, you can use, uh, wireless things. So, oh crap, I... I made a boot. Uh, made a boot. Yeah, I did. So, but the thing is, um, we gotta destroy this. Oh. Because this is gonna be with tubes in it. Oh, all of these around? All of these. Oh, really? Uh, okay. So, same on all drives, or? Yeah, and uh, pay attention here. It's Still, this guy, so that the second one is gonna be like. Okay, so it's only um, till the drive then. Yeah. So like that, I guess. Right. Because um, that is basically uh, the reason I do that is. Uh, this thing will power, uh, well not power, it'll, it'll uh, uh, give us the redstone signal for the thing. Yeah, of and, um, I wanted to have, this is a kind of a tricky part, and uh, um, tube. Tube. Front tube, the one without the redstone signal. Because I made this really compact and I went around this and changed a whole bunch of stuff. And I got this to work pretty well, actually. Awesome. And that is not mine. No? Okay. Um, bad box. Wait, we need to... Yeah. That is not right either. <laughs> What's not right? Oh. Uh, okay, so this guy... Well, let's keep it like this. Um, so we basically did everything wrong twice. Uh, well, I wouldn't say that. Are we supposed to have um, red sun tube connected to the battery box? Uh, because well, the that's battery box. Why well, we had panels there, but. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Should I like place them again? Because now there isn't any else. 
Yeah, we should just get rid of the battery boxes for now. And those right. panels are right there. And make sure that this block is uh, a tube without a redstone. Otherwise, it'll <laughs> end up uh, pulsing for every direction. Uh, it'll pulse all the frame motors. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Which um, is not very good. Uh, mm, I'm, I suppose that's not what we want then. And what is wrong here? If I this and block this here guy is wrong. This block there is wrong. Yeah. It's supposed and to that be that. that. No, wait. That, that better. That one. There we go. And okay, so this is alright. This is pretty good. So right. Now we just place these guys back. Just stay alright. And okay, let me figure it out. Yeah, I think this was alright. So wireless receivers go up here. Ah, <laughs> There. Yeah. Okay. And so wireless receivers on on here. Okay. Uh, facing towards the one with the pipe. <laughs> So outward, yeah, yeah. I'll let me get a screwdriver. There we go. Because I'm gonna need it. Okay. Yeah. So and I will need a hollow cover. Oh, hollow covers. Uh, a hollow cover? Well, not a cover, a panel. Oh. Because you do want the things to still connect. And I also want. A uh, jacketed, jacketed wire. Jacketed, not a brick thing. Okay, so about right. Uh, this thing is gonna be like that. And okay, panels and all these, and then a jacketed wire there, I guess. Yeah. And a redstone alloy a wire. Wire under there. Yes, you do. You do indeed. And then, oh, and it's gonna be like that. So, there we go. Like that. And this thing is gonna pulse uh, the motors. And I, the way I, I set it up is, you just ride this thing to a new location because it's not gonna be very often, uh, with a wireless uh, a remote in your hand, and you just like pulse the direction that you want to go. And like go 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 go, and then <laughs> go 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 go. Yeah, so uh, this thing will slowly go the way you want to, and oh, that, that's basically it. And okay, I need the, the things there. We need a screw. We need to orient these somehow, some when, what? whenever. The motors. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Wait, are you just? I'm doing Why? hollow covers. Yeah. Ah, to make it look even prettier. Yeah, because it's gonna be another brick thing. Yeah. Okay. So this is alright then. Uh let me see. Frames have a lot of functionality I don't even know about. <laughs> for exa for example these hollow covers, I would never have thought about that. Well they're panels because covers would still work as a cover so it won't uh uh, uh drag along this this uh yeah. Wire. So yep. it's it's very yeah functional and like okay. So um, the thing is below this thing, as you can see, uh, we've got in a square right around here. It's very symmetrical. Oh wait, uh, <laughs> this yeah, guy he shouldn't um, connect. Oh oh yeah. I think I messed up again. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I'm doing this by head if you haven't noticed. But so this guy shouldn't be a frame thingy. Okay. Like with the without the the tube thingy. But this uh, this guy should. So this guy goes away, this guy goes away. And then that guy goes away. I guess on all sides then. Yeah, yeah, it has to move one.
Oh, yeah, if, if, if you just, you know, do that, then we'll be fine. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Maybe you would be so kind to do that. Do what? Like, make it work. <laughs> well, make it uh, uh, move the things one over. Okay, so this is going to have, so this one needs to be a cheap frame then. Okay, so the way I set it up in my world was like this. I have a tube network here that will basically uh, uh, make the batteries uh, 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 always put always full batteries in there. So, but it can't connect with uh, 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 with the tubes. So uh, it can uh, be the same redstone poles. So because then it will, would try to move in all directions, which is yeah, bad. that would be the bad part of it. So this is <laughs> alright. There we go. Thanks that I think that's fine. Okay. And I, think uh, I, did, I have right? a yeah. panel uh, on each of those sides of the battery box because a redstone signal will disable the power output of a battery box. Which we noticed when Fuzz made a time <laughs> board. Yeah. So <laughs> that's why I've got that one here. And I know I have this guy here. We're gonna have to replace <laughs> this again, aren't we? Yeah. Uh, yeah. But your panels. You can uh, just like leave it out for now. And yeah, sure we. That we yeah, we don't even need to place them, do we? No. It's just for a second. Also. Oh, nice. Um. Let's pick the north side as the forward kind of thing. So yeah, it, we want yeah. to have the battery, uh, uh, the, the the recharging thingy on the front, I guess. So yeah, to make it pretty. Okay, oh, fell down. So and I tested this with a retrieve with two retrievers, but the thing is, I don't need two retrievers. I need uh, one filter and one retriever. Mm, yeah. Because a retriever that's right next to uh, uh, a chest is just a filter. So yeah, and it senses uh, sends it to the nearest available inventory, which is always the battery box. Uh, yeah, because at least one of those battery boxes. Yeah, because the retriever's um, front face, uh, where it pulls from, is not a valid inventory. So. Okay, so this guy there. You're making this very compact. <laughs> yes. Which is awesome. This is the way I thought it up, and it's the way I'm going to do it. Because We're going to need a frame up here, right? Yes, but we have something in mind for that. Ah, of course <laughs> we do. Of course, of course we, do. we do. Okay, so this thing will get the empty ones out of the machine. So this is the forward side, and it will pulse the things. So do you think we're... <coughs> sorry? Okay, and this guy, this is the filter, I think I faced it the right way, because this one will get the yes. full ones out of the energy. Yes, um, so. do you think I'm fine to place the battery box now? We, we, uh, we shouldn't have anything me messed up now, right? No, you can place it, yeah. To make this work, like, yeah. otherwise it, yeah. <clears throat> okay, so this should be pretty good for now. Yeah, um, it looks good. Looks good. Okay. Looks valid. This is all right. And on the other side, we want to have uh, also a bunch of frames out here. And what we need is one of those jacketed wires. Uh, like that. And probably on the panel with a wire. And this one is panel 2, and that should be a uh, wireless uh, transmitter as well, a uh, receiver as well. So okay. a wire and a wireless receiver. This thing will pulse the... Uh, 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 how often uh, it will uh, refresh the batteries. And it's... Right. Yeah. It's right. not for all of them at the same time, so remember that. But, yeah. 
At yeah, first, the retriever can only like pull one battery out at the time from one battery box. So it won't pull all four batteries. You need to pull it four times to pull all yeah. the batteries out. Yeah. Okay, so um, to get this to work, I need a bunch of batteries. And that's the good part by having it set up like this. Because if you have multiple battery boxes um, like connected to each other, you would have to use two retrievers. And if you're doing this from um, like survival, retrievers are like, you know, I don't like crafting on retrievers. <laughs> I like like filters, and filters are easy, so the less retrievers, the better. <laughs> right. um, so panels goes here still, right? For the uh, receivers. Just, yeah, something like that. Uh, but, wait. So this guy does Plus? full ones. Plus? Yeah. Will you just like come up here for a sec? Yeah. Um, why don't we just do... Oh, that then... big won't do help. That won't do because it needs a wire to uh, send a signal. Oh, big, okay. But yeah. why... What is the difference here? Oh, because it's... Okay. <laughs> yeah, I see. I see. You see it, right? Yeah, I see it now. I, yeah. yeah. Derp. Okay. And to make it pretty, I'm going to make this thing also covered with a hollow one. So Ow. it'll be nice. Okay. Um, this thing is all right now. It's got a thing to pulse the, the retrievers, and I set this up to be all right. And now I need a blue wire. Eject the blue wire. Oh, I see what you're gonna do. You're gonna hook up this frame motor to the retriever. Yes. Smart, smart. You don't even need any extra frames. Nope. This goes like that. And I had the one on the other side too, but this guy doesn't even need any energy. So <laughs> it's a right. lot easier this way. Yeah, it is. At least. And it does the same stuff. So I'm pretty happy with that. And oh yeah, the way I had this, I think, because <laughs> I had it like this, and like that because um, I was gonna power the pump uh, wait why do you okay well okay go on sorry uh, <coughs> because the test version that I had uh, used um, like uh, the tank cars to uh, get the lava from it and into uh, portal gun portals and uh, get those to miscraft portals to the overworld but that doesn't really work because uh, cards in miscraft portals crashes the game For some and reason. I don't think we should try that on multiplayer because if it does crash then it's not very easily restorable <laughs> so. yeah so I'm not gonna do that I'm just gonna do uh, what I ended up doing was um, uh, using um, uh, uh, the the liquid Warden. transposers to fill cans up and put cans in an in a, in a chest. So easy enough. Ah. So oh, and let me get some lapis because I and the thing is the part with the liquid transposer is the part that I haven't fully figured out yet because I used a different system. <laughs> I'll help you. So that's the part where I'm also... Oh, wait. Okay. So that's the part <laughs> where I'm also not sure about this thing because I had this here to help me with... Uh, 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 the, because I needed a place to stand because I had a redstone energy cell right here. And I had something right. below it to keep it uh, standing there. So, uh, wow. and I needed a place uh, to stand myself to break it. So, Plus. and I didn't want to have the thing falling over. So, yeah. Plus. Yeah. Um, so you you said you powered the pump with a redstone energy cell. Yeah. Right. Okay. Well, this Magmatic is. Magmatic engine. What? <laughs> Magmatic engine? Uh, well, like, 
we do have a lava pump here. Yeah. And like a pump can only use up to like two Minecraft tools like as a total. So why don't you just like have a magmatic engine here? I bet you tried and it didn't work for some reason, so Well, I I wanted to have the simplest way of doing it and I was thinking like a redstone energy cell will last so long that you will not have to worry about it. So well. <laughs> it was like one block and like I'm done. So well. don't worry about the power. But we could do it with a with a with a energy. Ouch. <laughs> so um, we should actually. Um yeah. But I'm just gonna try something over here because magnetic engines do tend to stop for reasons. Yeah, uh, it's because they can uh, output like uh, almost four. four. No, they can output. They four. can output four. So, and you, if it only uses two Minecraft tools, then yeah, it kind of screwed. Yeah, I did try it, and I know it's less um, than two, two because like I had a machine using two and it ran at full speed, and the thing still <clears throat> like overfilled with energy, even though I had a pump and a machine using two. So. Okay, so... So... Have you got some lava? I need some lava. Yeah, on top of lava. I know, it was meant to be fun. <laughs> but, there we are. So, what this thing will do now, is basically just, you know, it's gonna, like, start producing power, and soon this pipe will be full, and it has nothing, nowhere to put the power, and it's gonna heat. Up. <laughs> <laughs> heat. Up. <laughs> right. Um, so I was thinking maybe a build craft gate has something to say like um, I'm gonna yeah, spawn if, in like the power is like way too much or something. Um, since this is an engine, I'm gonna see. Uh, like it, it has a thing for full energy because this thing has a, an energy capacitor. Like yeah. So maybe we could do like. Um, yeah, if, if it's got full energy, well, yeah, I don't know. So if it's full energy, it's going to stop, right? Well, if we set it to redstone signal, like that, and we disable that thing down there. Yeah, but now, as soon as the redstone signal is... Uh, 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 well... No, uh, I, I mean, as soon as the uh, capacitor is full, the energy stored is full, then it will overheat already. So then you're... Okay, well, that's true. But I was... Okay. So... But then if we do, like... Um, yeah. I don't know, if you have energy stored... No, you can't do that. Because if we do want to use a magnetic engine, we need a solution for that. Because the pump will eventually, like... You know, it will get stuck. Okay. I've got an idea. Really. Yes, you... Of course you do. How what about is... we use more than one pump? <laughs> I know it's kind of ridiculous over the top, but hey, come on. <laughs> hey, more lava. More lava. Well, then we and we use a blue electric engine because it kind of does adjust to how much power there is, right? Yeah, but then we need. Oh, we could use the, the, the battery thing, right? Yeah, exactly. Um, so but we then need we a battery box? Or? No, we don't need a battery box. Why do mm -hmm. we need that? Now? Well, we could just, you know, hook it up to this, because these will move, like, pretty much never. Yeah, <laughs> they pretty much never move. <laughs> so, yeah. So, like, if we had, let's say, like, you know, if we hook one of these up to, like, an electric engine, it would, like... Because we don't need a lot of power for this one. Well, I mean, we like, can on. just like do this. This guy. Uh, uh, we've got a wire here. We can use that to make it go up as well and out and stuff. Because <laughs> if we have a frame there, then just like thinking, and we hook it up like that, an engine, like right. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> it's it's best if you do it because you're good at compact. Okay, so. That is not one of them. Um, this guy. So... Uh, yeah. 
if we do that and the antigest is in the way which is not, not very good well because we the, the, don't the, really need to actually access this chest right no we don't because so it's an ender chest we can do this yeah and put the the energy thing there we need yeah. a frame down here though right. where this I've thing frame, this right? wire is not connected there's a wire here that's not connected the one at the bottom there oh yeah so there yeah that fixes it all right <clears throat> so if we were to like do that and like orient it orient 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 that way now okay. now it should already work do you know what we should do? Uh, you get a wireless remote and pulse the thing a few times. Uh, what thing? And Oh, right. We haven't oh, got the dude. charging system set up. Yeah. You know what? What if we uh, stop the recording and get a, wire, uh, 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 a blue twisty uh, thingy set up? Charging system in yeah. the overworld yeah. or something. So yeah, yeah we'll, 